countdown is almost over. EAA Air Venture kicks off tomorrow. But today our own Emily Deem is getting a preview of the high flying event. Good morning, Em. Hey, Angie and Doug. Good morning. Hi, everybody. Okay, the sun is shining out here at EAA. Things are looking bright for the kickoff, which is tomorrow for EAA Air Venture 2011. And if you can hear in the distance, we've got some tunes that are cranking this morning. The Warbird Tower is playing some music this morning, waking up the campers. We're out here in Warbird Alley. You know, there are tons of planes that you're going to see out here at EAA. We are on just a portion of 1,400 acres that they have out here, packed with campers and different aircraft. So we're going to be showing you a very unique aircraft right now. I have Bill Fisher, who is here with me. Good morning, Bill. Good morning. How are you? I'm doing well. How are right. you? Right. You are the executive director for the Warbirds of America out here at EAA, and we have a very interesting aircraft behind us. So let's go ahead and talk about this and what people will be able to see out here. Okay, this is a, a German FW-190. Uh, this was their frontline fighter during World War II. It took on the Russians on the Eastern Front. It took on the British and Americans on the Western Front. And uh, at the time, this was one of the Germans' uh, finest fighter airplanes. Wow, it is an amazing aircraft. Um, you know, a lot of people are going to be seeing this for the first time. How awesome is that? Well, this is a really unique opportunity for people to see something that's really, in my knowledge, has never been to Oshkosh before. Um, there's very few of these airplanes flying, and uh, this one was recently restored. Um, it's gone through its paces. It's in great shape, and we're just pleased that uh, um, one of our members, Rudy Frasca, was able to fly it up here uh, from Illinois and uh, our guests are really going to be surprised by the uh, aircraft and uh, all the work that has gone in to restore it and to flying condition. Okay, so I mean there are going to be like 10,000 planes out here this week for EAA Air Venture and tell us about the area we're on and how this whole showcase area is going to be jam-packed. Okay, the area we're standing on is called Scott's Warbird Alley and it's our showcase display area. Only the best aircraft in the Warbird community are invited to participate. We'll have fighters, we'll have uh, some really unique Navy airplanes here. Uh, this year is the 100th anniversary of naval aviation. So in celebration of that, on Wednesday, we're going to dedicate it as Navy Day. And there'll be some really neat airplanes that uh, have actually flown off of aircraft carriers here. Uh, they have folding wings and some really unique things. Uh, there'll be an amphibious airplane that can land on water or take off from land. It has retractable wheels and uh, wow. some really neat stuff. So we encourage people to come on out, visit uh, EAA Air Venture, and uh, stop by the Warbirds area. <laughs> okay, so I know you have your own section over here. Just really quick, that tower over there, tell me why they're playing music this early in the morning. Well, our members and volunteers get out here early. Uh, there's a lot of work to be done. So they, uh, every morning at about seven o'clock, they'll get on, they'll play some music, wake up the campers, <laughs> get them out here, get them over to their uh, uh, food shack for a little coffee and donuts and, and get ready for the day's activities. All right, Bill, thank you so much for joining us this morning in Warbird Alley, a place you can see if you come out here to EAA Air Venture, which kicks off tomorrow, lasts until Sunday. We've got all the information at fox11online.com. Click on Good Day Wisconsin if you want to get tickets, want to see show times. I got to put on my aviators. <laughs> I gotta Looking look cool. the part. Oh yeah. And the sun is shining. I'll watch the planes come in. We'll send it back to you. We just need some Top Gun theme music playing now. <laughs> yes. <laughs> All right, Maverick. We'll see you in a little bit. Well done. Well see done. Ya.